so my name's Glenn Wilder from New Zealand. I run a small uh, affiliate marketing portfolio of websites, I guess. Um, yeah, I used to run my own SEO agency, but I transitioned into my own sites. I was mainly outsourcing to agencies for um, content creation and the optimization of the content and, and publishing, and it was just very poor quality and often there'd be long lag time, so I was just having a kind of frustrating time with that and decided that I needed somebody to be a content manager for me. So that was the, the original kind of structure of the role, yeah. I was attracted by the idea of working with people from Eastern Europe because I have in the past. Um, caliber of English is, is very good, I'm aware of that. And I just heard a couple of friends say that they, they were having really good experiences there. So I was curious to see, see what opportunities there were. Uh, so Advertise got quite a lot of uh, candidates, actually. It was, it was really exciting. Uh, uh, the whole range as you'd expect, but some really high caliber people and then I was sort of choosing between three or four just deciding who I'd interview and then um, the person who I ultimately hired uh, submitted quite late in the piece and he was just, he was a, a very clear winner. So I, I did end up interviewing multiple people but I basically knew that he was going to be the one from the, from the moment he submitted. Well, so he, he began as a content manager, um, which he was excellent at. He created uh, SOPs for those processes. And then he basically just asked if he could start experimenting and doing other things, um, which I was very open to. And I actually initially said to him, I want 20% of your time to be just learning time as well. So he, he kind of jumped on that and got quite excited about it. So bought courses for him, he went through those courses and then he'd summarise them for me which was great because I hate going through courses, um, they kind of kill me. So yeah, he's eventually, he's evolved into what I now call my operations manager and he's hired three other people uh, under him who he manages and has built a whole onboarding SOP uh, and now, I mean, I, I often have periods up to a month where I'm just not working on the business at all and he legitimately takes care of everything. So it's, it's amazing, I, I feel very fortunate. It's made an immense difference actually, <laughs> yeah. I mean, it, it's a combination of things I suppose. Like it, uh, I, I feel lucky to have found the person I'm working with, um, but I had a really good experience with job rate. Like the, the caliber of the candidates was very high and I felt like I had you know, a good range to choose from. It wasn't, sometimes you submit these job posts and you get back and you're, there's one or two where you're like, ah, oh, maybe, maybe this will work out, but I can see a lot of problems. Whereas in this instance, I was looking at four or five people who, who I knew could do the job and one who was very exciting who I ended up hiring. Well, I now have uh, more than just a data set of one, so because the people he has hired are also from Serbia, uh, and they're all excellent. So I've got two full-time writers and then one person who manages our uh, link building outreach, and they're, they're really good. The English is excellent, very friendly, um, particularly good at sort of thinking on their feet and coming up with new innovative ways to approach problems, which is something I've struggled with in hiring in the past. Um, often I've had people who who really need to be handheld through everything, whereas all of these guys, um, in particular my operations guy, are very, very good at, at finding new solutions and, and looking for answers before they ask me, which is, which is great. No, other than I had a great experience with, with both Noel and Jobrec and I'm very stoked that I, that I made that decision, so highly recommend it.